Hi, I'm Timothy Young with Food for Thought. We're a specialty food company based on an organic farm in Benzie County, Michigan. And today I'm going to show you a dish that's a family favorite for me. It's acorn squash stuffed with sauerkraut and sausage. The ingredients involved are quite simple and they are pork link sausage. This comes from Land of Goshen Farm in Calva, Michigan. Definitely my favorite meat producers. The next item is Leelanau cultured veggies, traditional white sauerkraut. This is a lacto-fermented raw sauerkraut. It's wonderful stuff. The next item is going to be the acorn squash. These are found all over Michigan, of course. Um, these happen to come from Sweeter Song Organic Farm and CSA, which I am a member of. The other ingredients are basically black pepper and celery seeds. So this is a very simple, basic dish. The, um, the other items that are going to complement this are going to be organic maple syrup that we uh, produce here at Food for Thought. Um, this we're going to mix with a little bit of butter to glaze the squash. Then we're going to have a little bit of our cherry honey mustard on the side. And then for beverages, we've got a couple items. Since we're dealing with some traditional German ingredients here, I thought we would start with a Schwartz Brew Pilsner. This is brewed by, of course, Schwartz Brewery in Bel Air, Michigan. Wonderful Pilsner. And then we're going to go with a German tradition, the Gewürztraminer wine. This comes from Ciccone Vineyards, which is in Leelanau County, Michigan. Okay, so to prepare our squash, we're going to start by having them, basically destem them, and then you're going to split them down the middle from stem to tip. Whoops, almost lost that one. And then we're going to remove the seeds. Once you remove the seeds, then we're going to basically poke a few holes in them to let them vent while they're cooking, let some of the steam out. We're going to place them face down like this in a sheet pan and then bake them. Once they're baked, they're ready to assemble. Okay, so the assembly is actually quite simple. First, I start with a mix of 50-50 butter and maple syrup. And I'm just going to baste a little bit around the edges and inside the squash. Then I'm going to fill with the sauerkraut. Like so. Then I'm going to add my sausage. And maybe a little more sauerkraut if needed to puff it up a little bit. Next, the, the last garnish is really going to be um, a little bit more of the maple syrup and the butter mixture right over the whole thing. Then we're going to go and top it with just a little bit of black pepper and caraway or, uh, celery seed. So here's our celery seed, just a little dash of that. A little bit of black pepper. I don't know if it could be any easier than that. And then that is ready to pop in the oven. Okay, so we finished this in about a 350 degree oven for about 15 minutes and just to basically reheat it. It's ready to go. Now we're going to serve this with a little bit of our organic cherry honey mustard. And for beverages, we've got two options. We've got the Gewürztraminer wine from the Ciccone Vineyard, which is an excellent complement to these traditional German ingredients. And then we're also going to serve it with some uh, Schwartz Brewery Pilsner. Well, from Timothy Young at Food for Thought, that's how I eat in my home. Prost! Today's recipe is available online at 9and10news.com.